Hey there everybody, what is going on? So today what we are going to do is we are going to restore a site that we have backed up using WP Migration. Um, brand new uh, installation of local. So we're going to go over here to create a new site. Because first thing we got to do is just get some kind of an instance of WordPress going. So we'll go to create a new site. We'll click on that. Um, we can just name the site, whatever. What's your site's name? You know, right there, letting us know. Um, we're going to call it my practice site just because that's also the same name. Don't know if it matters as the site that I backed up before. All right. We are going to click on continue. And we're literally just going to keep all of everything default uh, per se. Um, but I am going to go in here and enter uh, the same stuff that I used before on the practice site. So what I'll do is I'll enter my username and password here, and then I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to leave everything else default. I'm not going to worry about anything else. It's not a multi-site, and I'll click on Add Site. All right, so right now it's wanting to allow access through the Defender's Firewall. Yes, that's fine. Uh, just click on Allow Access all the way through all of these. All right, so we are all set up, and it's popped open. And then right over here, I usually click this on and select the admin, so I don't have to worry about that when I go to log in. Um, and then once that's done, you'll just go to uh, open site. Like right now, if we open up the site, we should see a default WordPress site here. Let me pop this open for you. Opening up, taking a little bit, but there's the default WordPress site. It's actually opened up. All right, so we'll go ahead and we'll click on the uh, one click admin and then click on that and that's also going to open up our back end all right so if we scroll back down here what we want to do is we need to go and add a new plugin so that we can go and use that plugin to grab the, the backup files that we created so I'm um, gonna search for WP migration is the one that I've really been uh, uh, pleased with. All-in-one WP migration, there it is. We're going to install now. Activate. All right. And now down in here, we right here is our all-in-one WP migration. So now we're going to click on import. Import from, we're just going to drag the files over. I've got some files on a, in a window that are open. All right, let me go over here and grab those. And these are literally the backup files that I created using WP migration in my previous instance of WP local, I'm sorry, of local and uh, of, the, of the site that I had going at that time. So um, literally, Here's what we're looking at. I'm just going to grab this one from August 4th, and I'm just going to drag it. Uh, my mouse is just not working at all. No, I don't want to do a darn thing. I just want to drag this over and drag and drop files to import. All right. So if all goes well, this is going to install our theme. This is going to, the import process will overwrite your website, including the database, media, plugins, and themes. Uh, please ensure that you have a backup of your data before processing the next step. In this case, it's a brand new site. I don't care about any of that stuff, so it's not a big deal. So I'm going to click on proceed. Once it's all done here, we get a site. Your site has been imported successfully. Save permanent structure, opens a new window. Um, that's interesting. Gonna go and just open that up. Database update required. Update WordPress database. Sure. Continue. And it's actually wanting us to log in. That'll be interesting. We'll log in with all of our uh, passwords and everything. If we go back up here now, so we're in our site, we're in our dashboard, and uh, we now have, we're, we're back up and running with the backup that uh, we, we just restored. We've got the Astro 
theme uh, which was installed is there. Uh, we have, uh, if we go to our plugins, you're going to see a whole mess of plugins now that weren't there before. They're, they're there now. Um, and so we've successfully um, restored our uh, WordPress site into, into local.